WXBT Delta Weather. Mother Nature remind us that it is winter and we are in the month of February today as some very cool air made its way in across the Delta. But we started off very nice in the Delta. As you can see, Lamar Ashmore up in the money area captured this wonderful sunrise as it made its way over the horizon this morning right around 7 o'clock. And you can see not a cloud to talk about up in the sky and we saw blue skies all day long. And so with the clear skies that helped keep temperatures a little bit cooler as we had that northerly breeze blowing in that cold air as you can see right now we're sitting at 47 degrees in Greenville 46 in Greenwood Cleveland and in Jackson the other story is very dry air as you can see dew points all the way down into the lower 20s which continues the help with all the drying that we need after the storms that move through on Tuesday but as I mentioned we continue to have a very gusty wind out of the north northwest at about 7 to 12 miles an hour and so feel like temperatures are all the way down into the lower 40s and that's what it's been like all day long so it definitely has been very chilly to be outside on this Thursday. As you can see a feel like temperature right now 41 in Greenwood, 42 in Greenville. And we can see not a cloud to talk about across the entire Arklamas region and back across most of the plains as well. The showers that we had Tuesday are still slowly moving off into the east coast and will be riding up the east coast and could even provide some snow showers back across uh, Boston and up into the main area as you wake up tomorrow morning. Then we just have a little light snow showers back across the Great Creek regions, but you can see Nothing to talk about out to the west. And so as we go through the rest of tonight and into tomorrow, as that high continues to be to our west, it brings that north northwesterly flow. So it's going to be downright freezing by the time you wake up tomorrow morning. But then as we go throughout the afternoon hours, that high will slowly shift over top of us and then move off to the east ever so slightly. So we will have another full day of sunshine across the region. But then as that high begins to ever so slightly move off to the east, we'll see a slight southerly flow return and maybe temperatures get back into the lower 50s by tomorrow afternoon. So you'll notice maybe just a slight warm up. But as I mentioned, tonight temperatures will be dropping down into the 20s and some areas could fall into the mid 20s out to the east. You see 27 for an overnight low in Greenwood, 26 in Grenada. But as I mentioned, a little bit of a warm up for our Third Friday, as we can see temperatures getting into the lower 50s with plenty of sunshine, maybe a few clouds along the river. But other than that, just another day of blue, sunny skies. A few more clouds will move in on Saturday, still right around the lower 50s. Sunday looks nice, 57 degrees and lots of sunshine. But then things change as we move into next week, as we see temperatures falling once again on Monday down into the lower 50s with very breezy conditions making it feel only like the 40s all day long and then some real cold air will descend into our region as you can see dropping down the 44 degrees on Tuesday 48 on Wednesday before we're way back up into the upper 50s and maybe even lower 60s by next Thursday so you can see just a little short period of cold air in the middle of next week but things will begin to warm up as we head towards the end of next week all right so we've got to finish off the winter first before we can start yeah it's the back to the roller coaster a little bit yeah. so we're, we're going up the hill again mm -hmm. Sunday looks like the peak and then we fall mm -hmm. during the middle of the week but then we'll go back up by the end of next week mm -hmm. roller coaster ride <laughs> we might as well have fun yep. all right thank you Eric